Hello everyone who watching great news related to the Russia-Ukraine conflict. Please click subscribe and comment below the video to let me know. The footage shows Ukrainian aircraft attacked with high-precision GBU-39 bombs on a building housing personnel of the Russian Armed Forces in Vovchansk, Kharkiv region. In the next specific context, a Russian soldier pretended to surrender, but then launched a counterattack, leading to a close-range gun battle with the Ukrainian army. The Ukrainian forces were able to overpower the Russian soldier, revealing a weakness in the Russian troops involved in this engagement. When a combatant feigns surrender only to counterattack, it not only endangers lives in the immediate situation, but also erodes trust between opposing forces. This erosion of trust can have far-reaching consequences, making it difficult for soldiers who genuinely want to surrender to do so safely. As a result, we can easily predict the fate of Russian soldiers when faced with such danger. Besides, drones continue to play an important role for Ukraine in the ongoing wars with Russia, proving to be indispensable tools in both reconnaissance and combat activities. A recent general attack illustrates the strategic use of drones by Ukrainian forces. In this operation, drones were deployed to scout ahead and identify hidden Russian positions, including troops concealed in forested areas and armored vehicles in camouflaged encampments. Once these positions were mapped out, drones equipped with laser designators guided artillery and airstrikes to these locations with pinpoint accuracy. Simultaneously, combat drones carrying explosives were sent in to directly engage enemy targets. These drones successfully destroyed several tanks and armored vehicles, significantly degrading the Russian military's operational capabilities in the area. The coordinated drone assault not only inflicted substantial material losses on Russian forces, but also disrupted their defensive formations, allowing Ukrainian ground troops to advance with reduced resistance. As the conflict continues, the strategic deployment of drones by Ukrainian forces will likely remain a key factor in their efforts to counter and repel Russian military operations. In the recent incident I mentioned, FPV drones were used effectively to destroy Russian shelters and enemy troops in Krinky Village, located in the Kherson region. The first attack by the FPV drone targeted a specific shelter, causing the enemy troops to relocate to another house. However, the second strike was equally precise, resulting in further casualties and destruction. This type of drone warfare highlights the growing importance of technology in military strategies and the ability of FPV drones to conduct highly targeted attacks with minimal risk to the operators. As Ukrainian soldiers persistently target and dismantle Russian military assets, their strategic ingenuity and determination continue to be pivotal in their defense efforts. The documented successes in these videos serve as powerful examples of their ability to effectively disrupt and destroy enemy operations. The footage provides not only a glimpse into the harsh realities of the battlefield, but also underscores the significant progress and resilience of the Ukrainian forces. The relentless pursuit of victory and protection of their homeland remain at the forefront of their mission. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.